morning, my Feeding the Beast family. How is everyone doing today? Seriously, comment down. I want to know how you're doing because I care about you guys so much. That sounded that sounded like I was being a jerk. I do care about you guys though. Uh, I thought I would show you guys kind of what I take in the morning because I guess it is a full day of eating and it is part of what I kind of eat. So let me show you guys what I have been supplementing with. Every morning I've been taking two, so two of these, these are just omega 3's, just basically healthy fats. And then we have the alpha mints, I just got these in, it's basically just a vitamin. And then I've been actually drinking two of these every single morning. So, two of, so I'll drink, I'll drink like a, of those waters, I don't know how many ounces it is, it's probably like at least 20 ounces, maybe 30. Um, so I'll drink one of them right when I wake up, and then I'll drink another one. So I already drank one, and I'll drink another one when I take my vitamins. So that's what I'm doing. And then also I wanted to bring up, like, what... Some people don't even know, like, what these full day of eatings are and why I do them. So, um, I want to let you guys know that I... So I track my macros, um, on an app called my Fitness Pal, which is right here. Let me... Give me a second. Give me a second. Alright, so it's right there. So, that blue one with... 1,211 notifications. So I, I track everything that I eat on there. So that's why, like, you'll you'll hear me say like this many carbs, this many protein, um, because I track it, and then you can go and look at it. So like, this is everything I ate yesterday, right? So that's ev everything's on there. And uh, so that's why I do these full day of eatings because I track my food anyway. So I might as well show you guys what I'm eating. So some people wonder what it is. So the the app that I use is called My Fitness Pal. So I'm gonna go ahead and take these vitamins, and then I'll see you guys at meal number one right now. And we are in the kitchen for meal number one. Let me go ahead and show you what it is. Very simple protein pancakes. That seriously, like the the simplest recipe I've ever seen for protein pancakes, and it actually works pretty dang well. So let me go ahead and show you what it consists of. So what you're gonna need is one banana. I know that looks gross, but honestly, the riper it is, the more sweet it's gonna be. So that's all good. You need two eggs, one egg, and then just and then be the egg whites, and then a scoop of protein powder of your choice. I really like the peanut butter Quest protein in this one. So I'm gonna go ahead and get this all set up, and I'll show you guys what it looks like when it's all done. Alright, so there's the finished product. I realize it doesn't look all that great, but literally all you do is just mash everything together and then throw it in the frying pan. So that's, we got three pancakes out of it. And then we also, we're going to throw some uh, sugar-free breakfast syrup on there. And then I have 80 grams of oatmeal with some peanut butter. I think I'm going to make like a little sandwich. I think I'm going to put like oatmeal in between these. And then I'm also inside of that, I'm going to put this right here. I'm not sure if you guys have ever seen this before. But they're they're little like flavor drops. This is a mocha one, zero calories, super super good. I have it in my coffee right now actually, um, which is right there. So this is gonna be breakfast. I'm probably gonna make a little like sandwich thing, and I'll show you guys what that looks like too when it's done. <laughs> what do you guys think of my oatmeal pancake creation? I'm pretty excited about about eating this. I'm sure it will be delicious. So I'm gonna go ahead and eat this, and I'll check in with you guys at meal number two. I'm absolutely gonna be doing this again. This is delicious. Hey guys, so it is, now it's 1 o'clock and I am outside of the gym as you can probably tell. Oh, where my obese to be shirt, but I'm about to hit chest and shoulders. I'm going to try and record with this camera if I can. Um, if not, I did bring my little mini camera. Uh, if you want to know what this is called, it's called a Polaroid Cube. It's a little, has a little magnet on the bottom, you can place it anywhere. Um, so I'm about to go hit chest. I'm really excited, chest and shoulders, first time hitting it at the new gym. Um, I'm gonna try and get some film for you guys, I really hope I can because that would be awesome. And it sucks when I'm not able to, so I'm gonna go in there, right now, cue the over dramatic workout clips right now! <laughs> Alright, so I know I haven't um, updated you guys in a while. It is actually like 8 o'clock here, and um, 
I'm about to eat after my post-workout meal. I, I've talked about this a couple times before, but I like to eat in the morning and then I like to eat like way later in the day because I like to eat all my calories together because I like going to bed with the full stomach. So I actually prepped some chicken just now, so I'll go ahead and show you that. So uh, we have this chicken, so I seasoned it with, where's the seasonings at? So I did pepper, so just some regular black pepper, and I also seasoned it with this guy right here. This is pretty good. It's, it's kind of spicy, but we're going to do that. So we're going to do eight ounces of that, and then we're going to throw the rest in the fridge. And then we also just have one of these, um, the steam fresh vegetable packages, and we're going to go ahead and eat that, and then we'll get on with the rest of the meals because it's all going to come pretty quick now. There it is all finished up. We got eight ounces of chicken. Well, like seven ounces because I ate an ounce because I was really hungry. <laughs> seven ounces of chicken in there. And then we have just the packet of mixed veggies. And then we have some sriracha on top. So I'm going to eat this and then I'll check in with you guys at meal number three. All right, you guys, nine o'clock. So meal number three is going to consist of a few hundred grams of strawberries, a few hundred grams of grapes, this apple, pink lady. Delicious, by the way, pink lady apples. And then we're gonna do two servings, yes, two servings of Greek yogurt. That's gonna be a lot of Greek yogurt, but I'm down with it. So I don't know exactly how much strawberries and grapes we're gonna use, uh, either two or 300 of each. So we're gonna go ahead and cut this all up and put it in this bowl and then eat it. So it's gonna be delicious. <laughs> Alright, so here's what it looks like before I throw a bunch of Greek yogurt on it, and then I'll show you what it looks like when it's all not as pretty. <laughs> Alright, there it is all not pretty anymore with the Greek yogurt covering it. <laughs> I'm going to sit here and just watch, uh, I've been watching Daredevil. Is anyone else watching this? Uh, Daredevil? It's pretty good. It's just starting to get really good now. And I also wanted to show you guys that I, I just bought this mic. I'm pretty excited about it. It's called the uh, Yeti Blue Yeti or something like that. I don't know exactly what it's called, but I'm really excited about it. It's going to make the um, it's gonna make the voiceovers on all of the like workout footage a lot nicer. So I'm really excited to use it. I'm excited to eat this though. I'm gonna eat this, watch Daredevil, and then I'll see you guys at the next one. All right, for the next meal we have the protein before it's mixed up. So what we're gonna do? What we have in here is one half of a banana. We have 150 grams of frozen berries, we have four ice cubes, one cup of unsweetened vanilla almond milk, we have two scoops of protein, and then what I'm going to do and change up the, it's the Quest vanilla protein, and then we're going to actually put in some of these, uh, I showed you guys these earlier in the video, but these, uh, these flavor drops, it's the mocha flavored, oh it's so good, I, I tried this last night, so I'm going to do uh, just a few squirts in there, and then I'm going to put on top of that this is the puffed kamut cereal. I'm not sure if you guys know about this stuff. Uh, puff kamut cereal is really low, like it's like low in carbs, so it's very high volume. So you get a lot. Each serving of, of the puff kamut cereal is only 50 calories. So I'm able to do two servings in here and it's a good amount of volume. So I'm gonna go ahead and blend this all up and I'll show you guys what it looks like when it's done. And this is why I tell you guys not to mess with the recipe. You just got to make it exactly like I say and you will get the thickest protein of all time. <laughs> and there is the beautiful finished product that is protein. If you guys don't know what this is or haven't haven't heard of this yet, it is on, I have a video on it on my channel. Uh, just look up protein and it will pop up. Seriously, this is the best. It, I look forward to this every single night. So I'm going to eat this, watch more Daredevil, and see you guys in a little bit. Alright you guys, so it is 11 o'clock now, and we are at the final meal of the night. I should have just called this a full night of eating because <laughs> I mean everything at night. But I, I, that is a point I want to make is you don't have to worry about when you're eating as much as people make will make you think. The, what matters is calories in versus calories out. It doesn't when, matter when you eat, what you eat, well it matters what you eat. <laughs> it doesn't matter like when you eat at all, that does, that's not important. So it matters what, like how much you're eating, calories in versus calories out, okay? But 
Don't make fun of me for this meal, but this is what I'm eating for the end of the day. So what I got here is just two slices of bread with one serving of peanut butter on top, and then we also have two servings of Chex at the bottom of it. Right, and to look at the macro totals for the day, so I was at 51 grams of fat. Um, I was definitely a little low. I, I usually try and aim for about 60, but that's okay. Uh, for the carbs, I was at two, 323. That's pretty solid. And for protein, I was high, kind of, uh, 221 grams of protein. That's kind of what's been going on. I hear a lot of people complain about, like, Oh, my protein's so hard to hit. For me, it's like, <laughs> protein is the easiest thing to hit. And I, I go over on my protein almost every single day, <laughs> which I guess is not that big of a deal. But yeah, I just <laughs> I just think it's funny when people say, like, it's so hard for me to hit protein. It's like, a lot of times it'll be like these girls that only have like 130 grams of protein to hit. And I'm just like, what? I can eat that in one meal. <laughs> but yeah, that's what uh, the macros that were for today. I thank you guys so much for checking out this video. Thank you for... Um, just enjoying them and like I said, I'm not a cook and I, I just try and show you guys what I eat and what works for me And a lot of the stuff is stuff that you've probably seen before on the channel And I'm, I mean, I'm just being honest with you guys. This is what I eat. This is this is what's been working for me So I hope you guys liked the video. Thank you so much for watching Make sure you like comment subscribe. There was one other thing that I wanted to say. Oh, yeah, yeah. Look up on my hip.